to me it's it's about my my favorite part really is getting to know the person and be it, it, you know that happened so much but like before we're making it and then also discovery in doing it you know that because uh, it is is about at its best about discovery something you didn't know was there before and uh, it's so it's it's during the making of it that's the only time that I have any control <laughs> or say about it after it's done it film is a director's medium it is the director who is the storyteller you know directing where to place the camera and point it to tell the story even if you turn down the sound you could follow the emotional story of it and uh, it uh, so it's it's after that and seeing it when I watch a movie uh, for me it's it's uh, it's a little bit separated because I remember what we were doing that day I remember oh well that even though it's at the end that's the first scene we shot uh, what was going on in my own life during that day for me the 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 closest I get to being it an audience member for the first time experience is when I read the script and, and how it makes me feel or when I'm taken by the story. That's the only time that I get to have a first first time experience like an audience. I like I like true stories because they because if they were fictional you wouldn't believe them. <laughs> you know, uh, true stories are unbelievable that's uh because life takes twists and turns that we don't think of and uh um it's uh the hill is a father-son story i think and reagan is um reagan is uh, uh he, he was my favorite president at, at the time when i came of age the first president i voted for i uh i he was like america's dad whether you liked your dad or did not like your dad, <laughs> you know. So I, uh, I mean, I voted for Reagan. I came home. I had a roommate. He said, who'd you vote for? I said, Reagan. He said, you were kicked out of the hippies. And so <laughs> that was that. But uh, he was a great man, a very interesting man. I, I, I tried not to play him as an idol. I tried to, you know get down to what I love about acting is what makes people tick I think it's it's more it's more challenging on a somebody that's true that's real because um, you want to be true to that to them if somebody was doing a movie about my life you know I wanted them to play it from my point of view because I live my life from my point of view and then you know, and then make up your mind from, uh, from you know, you can make up your mind uh, otherwise about that. But I try to do it from their point of view, yeah, respect for the for the character. But I also, you know, I don't want to. I just try to get to the the truth. You know, take away the celebrity, take away the take away the <coughs> uh, the. That you know, they're so known, or that the title that they have, and who are they? Who are they as people? You know, they're like us. They're like you know. That's the way we can relate to them. They're like us. They have their insecurities. They have their faults. They have their their uh, assets. Their the personalities, the good and bad. You know, they have a history. They have a secret history. They have. <laughs> you know, we all have that. Yeah. So, and that we have all have things that we don't even know about ourselves, you know, that, so, uh, that's what's so fascinating. Yeah. You know, I started playing, I was a musician, bef you know, before I was an actor, you know, I was 12 years old, alone in my room, and, yeah, I guess it's like therapy, it's like a diary, it's like, uh, it's just something I, I'm a songwriter, but it's because... It's like an affliction. It's something that won't leave me alone and so, until I do it. And it's also a great way to, sh to have fellowship with people, to communicate, to, 
and you know, it's uh, music is the language of God. You know, you, you, with music, uh, everyone, no matter the language, you you really understand, you feel, because it's about feelings. <laughs>